Now, the other option for rotating viewports is to simply type in dView. So that would be D-V-I-E-W and hit enter. Now, for the next tip, I know many of you may need to rotate your view. This can be super useful for mechanical parts in particular, but also helpful for site plans and occasionally floor plans. So in our case here, you're going to want to make sure that your viewport is unlocked. And if you haven't already learned this tip, make sure you watch some of my other viewport videos, but you can unlock and lock a viewport by clicking the lock symbol down here on the bottom bar. Uh, also, if it's locked, you can see I've clicked inside and I can't move the view. But as soon as I unclick that view, lock button. Now when I hold down my middle mouse button, it's going to move around the view. If I choose this viewport over here and I move around, it's not going to move because it's still locked. So going back to our unlocked view here, you have a few options to rotate a viewport. I'm going to show you three of them quickly here. Now the other option for rotating viewports is to simply type in D view. So that would be D V I E W and hit enter. Once you do that, it's going to select all of your objects and you just need to type in TW for twist and hit enter. Now you can change that twist angle to anything you like. You can also freehand uh, rotate the view and this isn't going to affect your model space or any of your objects, just what's visible in this view. So say I want a random angle or something even more common, like we're going to type in 45 degrees and hit enter. Hitting enter again ends that command and you can see now I've got a floor plan at 45 degrees. Now the nice thing with using this command is it's not going to mess with your scale when you do it if you're not scrolling in and out, zooming in and out. But now I've got a 45 degree angle view of my floor plan or part or whatever I'm showing. And I can simply relock my viewport and now I can move it back around, click to get out. And I've got a 45 degree view on this one and a 90 or perpendicular up and down view on this one.